Ladies and gentlemen, good morning. Good morning, good morning. Hi, Bob. <laughs> On behalf of the Commanding General, Marine Corps Installations East, Marine Corps Base Camp Lejeune, Brigadier General Robert F. Castelvi, welcome to this morning's groundbreaking ceremony for the Department of the Navy, Marine Corps Base Camp Lejeune, and Duke Energy. We are pleased that you have joined us for this special occasion. Guests are requested to remain seated throughout the ceremony, except for those occasions when you will be requested to rise. You're also asked to turn off your cell phones and remain seated until the conclusion of the ceremony. The invocation for today's ceremony is being given by Lieutenant Commander Danny B. Purvis. Let us pray. Almighty God, I thank you for the opportunity to gather here this morning for this occasion, and I thank you for loving us more than we could ever understand and bestowing more grace upon us than we could ever imagine. I thank you, Lord, for the precious gift of liberty that you have bestowed upon us and for entrusting us with the sacred task of defending that liberty here and around the globe. And even as we celebrate here this morning, we have comrades in harm's way, Lord. Watch over them, protect them, and bring them home safely and soon. And Lord, for our comrades who tragically lost their lives yesterday, may you be with their friends and their families, and may they feel your grace and your peace as they go through this difficult time and remind them, Lord, they do not go through it alone. Lord, you have given us this beautiful planet and placed us as stewards of your creation. As we gather here this morning, may we be reminded of the integral part you have given us as caretakers of the earth. May we use the technology that you have given us to make this a better world and to do our small part to help take care of the planet with which you have blessed us. Lord, I ask you to bless the work of our hands, this great Navy Marine Corps team, and God continue to bless the United States of America. For it is in your name that I pray. Amen. Ladies and gentlemen, please rise for the invocation and remain standing for the March On of the Colors, followed by the playing of our national anthem. <laughs> 